Hello there, welcome back to Simple Home Gym Workout Series. My name is Jay Wen. Today we are going to work on our shoulders. So for shoulders, we're going to start with a simple backpack. We're going to do Arnold Press. Okay, I'm going to use a backpack here. So from the start, palms facing you. You can hold two bags or you can hold one bag at a time. So from here, you are going to rotate outwards. Press upwards towards the ceiling. Come back down. Inhale, exhale. So you want to push away from you, keep your shoulder blades down. You don't want it to go too far. Just nice up, rotate upwards all the way. Then bring it back down, elbows turn and rotate. So the weight is dependent on how much you put inside and the repetition also adjust accordingly. For a lighter weight, you might want to do more. And for heavier weight, you want to do lesser. So that is something that you should take note of. Now we are going to go for triple arm raises. Okay, so I will need two pills. You don't want to fill it to the brim, just halfway there. So from here, hold your two pills. We're going to go sideways, lateral raise. So keep your elbows slightly bent throughout the whole motion. Even for the other two movements, okay? So focus on elbows going up. You want your elbows to go up as high as you can and not so much on the wrist. It's more of the elbows towards the ceiling, coming back down. And don't shock your shoulder too much. Just nice, pull away, bring it back. After the lateral raise, we are going to do 45 degrees angle away from you. Exhale when you go up. Keep your knees soft. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Okay, and for final one, you're going to work the front. Control the weight as it goes up. Don't let the water move too much. That's why we use a pail. For shoulders, we have three different heads. So you have the front, the side, and the back. For this movement, we are working on two of the heads, the front and the side. We're going to max out, do 20 on each without stopping. And after you're done, then you get to rest. Next up is reverse fly. We're going to work on the back of your shoulders. Okay? So from here, lean forward. Keep your back straight. Breathe out as you go up. Look down 45 degrees angle. Hang a little bit at the top. Come back down. Pull away from you. Imagine you're flying. There is a pencil right in between your shoulder blades. Peel off the center of your body. Exhale going up. Inhale coming down. Alrighty, now we are on to our last exercise. We're going to use body weight. So we're going to have a chair for advanced version. From here, you're going to push against the wall. Make sure it's nice and sturdy. We're going to do pipe push up. So feet up on the chair. Keep your head behind your ears. And inhale going down. Exhale coming up. Press away from you. Make sure you feel all the way in your fingers. Keep elbows close and tuck in. You don't want your elbows to open up too much. Then push your hips as high as possible. Alright. So this is the advanced version. For the regress version, we are going to put away the chair. We're going to use body weight. Create a part with your own body. So a nice V shape. Push your feet on the ground. Same. Keep your head behind your ears. So from here, tuck your elbows in, go down, push it up, go down, push it up. Notice that my heels are also coming up as I'm going down. So that helps to create more pressure on your shoulders. And that helps to push your shoulders to another level. Okay? So this is the end of workout series for shoulders. Have a good day. See you soon.